Josh Hutcherson and welcome to my Teen Vogue photo shoot. I never got to go to a real prom, not once, and it's kind of sad. I'm getting to do it now, which is nice. Actually, I went to a homeschool prom once, um, which is exciting as it sounds, uh, I will tell you that. We, uh, it was a bunch of homeschool kids in Kentucky, and we uh, went to the local church and uh, stood awkwardly while they played music, and that was the extent of that. <laughs> One of the things that's, that's made the Hunger Games really successful amongst the readers, it's kind of just an interesting commentary on society on top of the fact that it's this interesting world that I think people really uh, get caught up with. If you look at kind of where even reality TV is today and, and, and where the world stands government-wise, it's kind of not too crazy to believe that at one point we couldn't get to having our own Hunger Games for entertainment. When I got the call that uh, I had been hired as PETA, I, I was literally speechless. I could not say a word. Uh, so in that, in that very moment, I was just shocked, amazed, and, and honestly it didn't even really sink in until I went on set for the first time. Uh, when I was finally like, oh my god, like here I am, like blonde hair, like in the get up, and I'm, I'm PETA, and that was, that was a huge moment for me. Yeah, it was pretty physically demanding. There was a, there was a lot of running around and, and jumping and, and reacting to explosions and whatnot. I grew up playing like soccer and, and baseball and, and basketball and everything, but uh, they actually wanted me to put on about 15 pounds of muscle for the role. So I had to uh, eat a lot of food. It was a lot of like chicken and broccoli and chicken and eggs and chicken and, and a lot of late, uh, weightlifting on top of that. So it was, uh, it was quite the challenge, but we, uh, we got to where they wanted it, so. Well, I love acting. I've, uh, I've always wanted to be an actor my entire life. But uh, for me, I also like getting behind the camera with producing and writing, and, and I also want to direct at some point. So that's definitely, uh, th that's in my sight for sure. I haven't felt more connected to a character than PETA um, with any kind of script or book or anything that I've read before. I think that there's a certain idea that uh, PETA has about, about people that you should maintain who you are as a person no matter what you're faced with or what circumstances you're put into. And for me, that's like one of my most like steadfast kind of beliefs as a person. So I definitely shared that quality with him. Thanks for checking out my Teen Vogue photo shoot.